Hey everyone. So we're back at 650 feet. Uh, so far we've been doing okay. Uh, we've done really nothing much with evasion, but we've really boosted our uh, melee by quite a bit. We can still keep going on that. Um, and I've just been sort of adding abilities as needed. I'm trying to remember... Yeah. So we've got a couple more points of will. We'll have some really good critical resistance, but that's not a huge priority right now. Uh, we got Constitution. The only other thing from the will tree we might want at some point might be Poison Resistance, depending on how that goes, but we're okay so far. Um, with the rest of it, we're still kind of waffling on momentum, and Knockback might be good at some point, and Strength, but it gets expensive. Uh, so right now, I think we should probably just focus on some basic stuff. Um, boosting skills and that sort of thing. Let's see what we get ourselves into. Uh, this is the stage where you can start to meet some of the different serpents. Not just the red and blue ones, but the, there's some darkness causing ones. And um, some like uh, multi-chromatic ones that can do all kinds of stuff. Oh, this is bad. So this is exactly what you don't want to happen is this character. I don't know how many of those guys are coming from the other side, too. So we're just soaking up the damage right now, it's fine. Um, I'm guessing that's a Serpent. But I think, yeah, we got a Frost Ring last game. So this is really bad, because I don't want to fight in the small space, but I also don't want to go somewhere I don't know yet. Okay, so that Serpent is not that bad. I'm gonna try and get out of the way so he can torch this troll to death. Where'd he go? And is that a shadow? And that's fine. Is that a Kamen Roko or a Sol Roko? Sol Roko, that's fine. I was hoping to position the Ruby Serpent so that he would burn the Soroko. Stop that. Damn it. So there must be some kind of like vaulty thing going on in there. What is with all these Soroko? This is ridiculous. Where'd that serpent go? There it is. How do you guys, how do trolls sneak up on me? This is insane. Oh, okay, so that was exhilarating. Oh, it's a forge. That explains it. Actually, if this had been a smithing character, we probably would have done all right. We've seen, I think, quite a few of them. Wow, okay. I don't know how much we'll need restoration because we have some pretty good will. I don't know if we're going to get drained too much. Um, we have a lot of food, too. Yeah, I think I'm just going to ignore it. That's fine. I'll worry about it later. We have sort of the stat potions that we would need for the things that we actually care about. So maybe dex. Uh, and the only things that are really going to stat drain us after this are vampires. And I think we have enough will that that's not a huge problem. Oh, I have a lot of experience. Mm. That's probably a shadow spider. Or a creeping horror, actually. Nope, it's a shadow spider. Where'd you go? Really? How can I not see this? Oh, is it a bat and another? 
I'm really confused as to why I couldn't see a shadow bat. Are they darker than shadow spiders? That's confusing and worrisome. Um, sure. So before Kevin Roko show up, it would be ideal to have um, Song of Sharpness. We're probably not going to get there. I've been kind of dicking around, not really thinking about, you know, a strategy. Um, but that would be sort of an ideal thing to have. Otherwise, I think we're going to have a hard time dealing with them. I really don't like exploring these little things, but they seem to be pretty common right now, so. And you can see, I mean, even the enemies who hit relatively hard before, this crit resist thing is, is helping us out quite a bit. They're not really even scratching us anymore. Um, trolls and like the big hitters will still continue to do damage because they don't need crits to do that. What is this? Dark trap. Uh, but cats and stuff, they've really had their sort of claws removed at this point. Let's go over here. to this level so far, guys. There's, uh, I mean, all my worries right now are for the future, not really for the present, uh, which maybe I should be careful. If the Balrog shows up or something, sure, it's going to be scary, but so far we're doing okay. The only thing that could really ruin our day would be Kevin Roka, and if I keep saying it, one will probably show up, so... That's a Poison Serpent, I guess that's pretty bad, too. This, this is probably going to be pretty bad. Um, or not. We were very lucky. Grinding noises, again, should make you nervous at this depth. There might be nether worms, but it, then again, it might not be. Oh, I see what's happening here. That's why I couldn't see it. Um, I'm used to shadow spiders using the greatsword to, to get some extra light, and it doesn't work on the bat because... Obviously, these swords don't slay bats. I'm not sure the elves are really concerned about making swords of bat slain. Uh, this is probably another worm, actually. I don't think Kevin Rico really... Oh, wonder. Unless they're woken up. Exciting times. This is the problem with these huge levels, I'd. It takes forever to, uh, to get a dent into them. But I would really love to find, like, a, some kind of equipment that gives con. Okay, so if you see darkness near demons, you should be worried, because A, if they hit you, it really hurts, but B, uh, I think Balrogs, actually, they flame from in between, so you'll know it's a Balrog. This is a creeping horror, so let's get this out in the light where we can see it. I don't actually need to fight this thing, but I want to.
Uh, I don't understand how I'm missing it. Yeah, most of our stuff can't really be damaged, it's just the cloak. Kind of a bummer, but... That I would like to carry around. This is getting really hard. I don't really know what to get rid of. I guess true sight. I know it seems crazy, but I could probably get rid of food instead, but three Lembas is pretty good. Now that we have 20 melee, I might genuinely take um, momentum pretty soon and just see where we can go with that. Well, that fixed that problem for us. If you ever can't figure out how to balance the stuff in your inventory, just fight a serpent. And they'll figure it out for you. And you kind of want to get a charge off on those guys if you can. Um, it works a lot better than just trying to whack them. Another one. Creeping horrors are pretty popular here. Oh, and a poison serpent. Great. And a giant. Hmm. And a werewolf? What's going on? Let's see if this... Wow, this is a lot of dudes. Um... That's the worst. Uh, I have sprinting right. I'm gonna. Hi. Sweet. Okay. We're lucky because I think most of our equipment is enchanted. So there's those acid dudes. I guess they can bust stuff in my inventory. I never really thought of that. But they're not really going to damage anything except our cloak. So with high strength, those webs aren't so scary. And free action, I think, helps as well. So we're in a good situation for that. Um, that's my great sword, hot key. Okay, that was exhilarating. Did I actually see what was in here yet? Wow, why are we finding so many of these? We should just switch to archery and win. Uh, what the hell? Okay, good floor. Let's go see what's next. They're not critical resistant. Let's see if I can deal with them with just the sword. Yeah, the sword's actually better. I should quit screwing around with his axe. Um, sure, yeah, I don't care. What's this? Sure, it's better than my plus one cloak. Uh, let's go find the staircase down. 
Is that a shaft or a staircase? Yeah, I don't want that. Let's go over there. Yeah, looks like that's the closest one. Another serpent. So let's just see if I was lucky last time. No, we can get some decent criticals that way. Oh, did I open that chest already? Damn it. I never noticed that chest there before. Uh, I hope I opened it. No, I don't think I did. Right, let's see if we can... I'm just going to hang out here a bit to see who wakes up and who doesn't. Dagger shadows neat. It's a lot of dragons. I think that was a sword thing. Yeah. Wow. Is that three little dragons together? This is, this is crazy. Uh, was that a Balrog? And did I just lose stuff? Okay, this is a lot of things happening at once. So now we're in a better situation to take care of this guy. We had Defiance. He only has 80 health. We have enough for momentum. However, I... Hmm. We have way more consumables than we should, actually. Weird. Except for quickness. Which we might be able to mimic, so let's try this. I guess strength, is that really going to matter? Yeah, it'll matter a little bit. That way I don't have to worry about getting a charge off every time. So let's go strength, and let's go constitution. We don't have dex, did they? I think they blew it up. Okay, I'm tempted to use a light staff here just to uh, get rid of some of this dark aura he has around him because I don't want to get hit. Ow. Like that. The Sorok was really causing problems. Way better, Robo Majesty, boots. It's pretty lame. So I'm not sure if any of that was worth wasting a con potion on, but we got some experience for it. What is this thing now? Good stuff. Those are actually really good boots. I would rather have the free action though. I'm 
Nice. Not nice. Mm. This might be a reasonable time to get rid of all this liquor. Might as well. Okay, we're full, that's enough. Um, the liquor is good because it can stop you from being feared, but the odds of us getting feared right now are pretty minimal. We have effective like 28 will against fear. Okay, so that's a shadow spider. Are shadows slow? Or was I sprinting? Yeah, I was sprinting, I guess. You've gotta be kidding me. This is ridiculous. Nope, ours are better. Oh, that one has more protection. I'm not going to trade off one attack for one protection, so... I wish I could wear two pairs of gloves. That would be pretty sweet. Can you imagine seeing this guy just like running in circles in this room? Where did all those cats go though? I didn't really kill them all, did I? I guess I did. Oh, neat. It's one of those fancy quartz rooms. This is one of those rooms that I always go and open up the quartz and then I regret it. Um, <sighs> oh, really? I thought I could do quartz with a shovel. I guess not, so we'll never know. Hopefully I'll find a metox somewhere. Because usually there's good stuff in there. Often it's a forge, but... I normally try not to rest, because uh, it burns turns, but... Uh. So I'll just let them stab me here forever, I don't care anymore. Like, Thanks. Servant has nine lives, okay. 
So I told you there were going to be multiple colorful serpents on this floor, and I wasn't lying. Uh, deep breaths. I actually don't know what I'm going to do with this experience. You've got to be kidding me. Don't you guys have something better to do? Like, doesn't Shalob have dinner parties or something? Nido. This might be an impossible place to fight this dude. They're crit resistant, right? This is where the battle axe might actually be better. 2d9, 27, actually. We're sort of each other's worst enemy. Uh, that's a Kevin Rico. I'm out of here. So those death blades are, uh, what do you call it? Like, kind of territorial? Oh, actually, this isn't so bad. So the absolute 100% goddamn worst thing about counter is they can basically kill you in a couple hits, but it's really hard for you to do damage to them. And then when you finally get them down to any sort of HP, they run through, literally through the level. It's like the worst worst thing. Uh, so he's probably drilled a hole up here. Oh, I didn't kill that death blade, did I? No. Let's go back and take care of him. Do you want to come out here where I can flank you a bit? Okay, maybe the battle axe is the best bet. I feel like I'm being tickled. Stop it. Good timing, too. Plus two, not a bad one. Are you guys breeding or something? Where are you coming from? Oh, shoot. Oh, nice. Okay, we definitely want to keep that. Uh, oh, sorry. Hmm. Well, this staff of light, we're swiftly running out of charges. This freedom staff hasn't really been super useful. Yeah, I guess light it is. I mean, it is handy, but we haven't really... Oh, sorry, we're about to run out of charges on it anyways, and they're reasonably common. Hopefully we can find another one. Oh, cool. Actually, oh no, I'm not throwing those. Different character. I was playing a dagger stabby character, which, for, which those would have been really good. He don't want axes have egos on them. Yeah. This neat little donut. Wow, that's a really good great axe. I always like to see... I mean, I took momentum now, so this is sort of pointless, but... Forty-nine. Pretty cool. So 
So I'm sort of tempted to take strength, because I have enough experience for it. Bitch. Well, no, those aren't nearly so good. Um, There's not a lit room for a pretty long way. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, I kind of want to take... Is this another one? Wow, this is awful. If there's really two of them, this is really awful. Luckily, they are slow, I think. Maybe they're not slow and it's the lurking horrors that are slow, but I'm pretty sure it was that. Oh no, that's a shadow spider. Is he in here? I just kind of want to see what was in his room. Meh. Okay, let's get out of here. So where's the staircase? There's one. Let's head that way. Oh, what was I saying? I kind of want stre uh, strength, but I sort of also want to pull song for song of sharpness because that's quite a bit. Oh, we're getting pretty close actually. And the other thing we really want soon is song of the. I would like to get song of the trees now. This is where things get tricky because I actually don't remember how the song prereqs work in real cell. They've been changed for MPA cell slightly. I think in real cell you need Elbereth to get trees, I'm not sure, or something. I don't think you can just go straight for it, but I'm going to, sorry. Because um, it's really handy once you get to Guatherco and stuff. And then uh, I'll get slain so I can get sharpness. I really wish I could get in here. I'm tempted to use a charge of my treasure staff just to see what we might be missing, but that's sadistic. Or masochistic, I guess. We'll drink the rest of our booze before we go. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, no, never mind. Okay. It'd be really great if we could find a better light. So just shimmy around this room and see what's here, but otherwise we're going to call it here, I think. Did I open that or did it just open? Okay. I think that's that's good for now. Let's go pick that up. This is how I get caught playing longer than I'm supposed to. Um, so let's see, are we at eight yet? Yeah, we're pretty close. So if we get a couple more, then we need 1,500 experience to get Song of Slain and Song of Sharpness after. Uh, so we're pretty close. And I mean, 34 voices isn't much, so we might want a couple of the other abilities, but uh, this will be fine for now. It's just to get us through uh, what's coming, which is once we get a little bit deeper, or if we're accidentally, or sorry, sort of unlucky and we stumble across a vault, um, ancient serpents have high protection, and I'm not confident we're going to kill them with this sort of damage output. Um, so we want sharpness for when that happens. Uh, it'd be cool to like wish that we'll get a sharp weapon, but that's probably not going to happen. Uh, and having more song, it still helps. Like Song of Slain works really well when you have high song, and Song of Trees definitely works well. Uh, in that case, so you can kind of go from there. But uh, thanks for playing along, and uh, I will see you guys next time.